to my channel. I hope you guys are doing amazing. Today's video is going to be a question and answers video for you guys. And I wanted to do this video because I asked you guys on Instagram and on my Facebook fitness group for questions that you guys want me to answer. And I got some pretty good ones, so I decided I'd do a Q&A. And I told you guys I was going to do a Q&A like three times, and I never did it. So today I'm going to do it for you guys. I'm holding my promise. So uh, I'm just going to get the questions here real quick, and then I'm going to go ahead and start answering them. Okay, so the first question in, from Instagram is from Emily Leon underscore underscore, and she says, Are you happy with your weight right now because you look amazing? Well, thank you, Emily, so much. And yes, I'm happy with my weight. It's not where I want to be, but it's not where I started at, so I'm very happy. I'm, you know, I'm not content with it right now because I really want to lose more weight. Um, but I'm very happy because I've come a long way and I'm going to go even further. So yeah. Um, the next question is from Get Wrapped PCB, and she says, "Have you ever tried that crazy wrap thing that tightens, tones, and firms in little less 45 minutes?" No, because I do not believe in that stuff. I believe in eating healthy and exercising to get the body you want. I'm not, you know, I'm not like saying that you don't have that you don't need that you can't use those because you can. It's your body; you can do whatever you want with it. But personally, for me, I just believe that eating healthy and Exercising is what it's going to make your body the way you want it to be. You don't have to use diet pills. You don't have to like starve yourself to see healthy and exercise and you'll get the body you want in no time. Okay, so the next question is from Mimi underscore Popovoski. Sorry if I butchered that. Um, what food do you usually eat on a regular day? Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, I'm not going to share that with you guys right now because I'm actually going to be doing a video where I show you guys what I eat for breakfast, what I eat for lunch, what I eat for dinner. It might be in three separate videos or it might be in one video. I think I might make it into three just because I can organize it more that way. So yeah, but that is coming soon. Um, the next question is from Ash D. Bieber and she says two questions. What country are you from and what religion are you? So to answer the first question. I am from America, but I'm half Palestinian, so that kind of answers that question. I grew up in the United States, but my dad is Palestinian, so I'm half Palestinian, and then I'm also like an eighth or a fourth German, Irish, and Scottish, so there that answers that question. To answer her next question, she asks, what religion are you? I am Muslim and I'm Palestinian Muslim. Okay, so the next question is asked by Sada, Sada Valdez. I'm sorry, I'm butchering these names, but um, she says, do you think your style has gotten better since you've lost weight? Definitely has gotten better. Um, not where I want it to be, but I'm trying to be more fashionable. I don't know if you guys can notice that in my Instagram pictures, but I'm trying to be more fashionable. I'm trying to actually put together outfits. I've always been into fashion and stuff like that. Uh, looking at my closet right now because it's right there. Um, I do have a lot of cute clothes and a lot of the clothes that I have are old clothes that I had when I was weighed more but I'm slowly like building up a collection of more stylish clothes so I definitely think my style has gotten better but it's not where I want it to be. I want to be even more stylish. Um, the next question comes from Y3ZZY Cam and she says how to be patient when you're on a weight loss journey. Patience is everything when you're losing weight because you're not going to see results overnight. You really have to be patient and you know let time take its course. You're not going to be able to lose like 10 pounds in a week. You know, you have to set reasonable goals for yourself, and that will that that comes with patience. So setting like a unreasonable goal is going to make you lose your patience. So setting reasonable goals is what really helps me keep my patience. Really helps me just keep on track. So that's what I'd have to say. Um, next question comes from Nicole Z Nicole O zero. She says, "Love that lip color on you. How often slash how long do you run on for on a normal trip to the gym?" Well, thank you. And this is Revlon's um, Cherries in the Snow lipstick. If you guys were wondering, and I usually run from anywhere from 15 minutes to 45 minutes, depending on what I'm doing that day at the gym. I always do something different. I really don't have a gym like routine at the gym, but when I start like going to the gym more because I haven't been going as much. I know I'm so bad, but um, yeah, I usually run from anywhere from 15 minutes to 30, 45 minutes. Um, I usually try to do an hour of cardio every single time I go to the gym. I usually do an hour of cardio, like 30 or 45 minutes of strength training. So um, I'd have to say most likely I run like 30 minutes every time I go to the gym. 
and Uniki, which is my friend from Oregon, thank you. She says, what is your favorite lipstick color? And by the way, I love your lip color. And I will thank you again. And I miss you if you're watching this video. And she says, what's your favorite lipstick color? My favorite lipstick color, let me see here. Um, I really like my Revlon Cherries in the Snow and Vivid Rose. And you guys have seen... Okay, that lipstick just fell. Whatever, it's rolling away. Um, this is Vivid Rose from the Vivids Collection by Maybelline. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful color. My favorite color. I wear this in like every single Instagram post. So yeah, you guys seem to have seen that a lot on me. Um, next question comes from Elizabeth Alejandra underscore. And she says, what's your starting weight and how much do you weigh now? I know a lot of people think that it's like weird to share your weight on the internet. But I don't know. I'm just not like, I'm not shy when it comes to that. I like being totally 100% honest with you guys. So my starting weight, which was... August 2012 was around 172, 175, 172, and now I'm 140, like three. So that's about, oh, like a, a little over 30 pounds, maybe like 30, 29, 32 pounds, depending on how you look at it. So yeah. And the next question comes from Y3ZZY Cam again. She asks tips on how to stop comparing your weight loss journey to others. This is a big thing that, um, this is a bit, this is a very good question because I myself personally, um, compare myself to others even though I shouldn't and you should never compare yourself to others because comparing yourself to others is just going to set you up for failure. So what I have to say for this is to not, I know it's, it's hard, but it's really true. You can't compare yourself. So stop comparing yourself to others. That's the first thing you need to do and really just focus on your goals that are right for your body, right for your life. So if you see somebody going to the gym like six days a week and you can't possibly make it to the gym six days a week but you really want to and then you beat yourself up over it, do not do that because it's not worth your time. It's just wasting your time. Set goals for yourself that are manageable in your lifestyle and that is going to help you stop comparing yourself to others and it's just really going to help you succeed. So that's what I would say for that. And the last question comes from Turk1963 and she asked, do you plan on wearing the hijab and which is like the Arabic scarf for your hair? I'm in that stage where I don't know if I should. What are your thoughts on it and do you plan on wearing it? By the way, I love you. You're such an inspiration. I love you too and thank you so much. And to answer your question, I don't plan on wearing the hijab. I know, um, I know a lot of people that do wear it and some of my closest family members wear it and I think that's perfectly fine. It's preference, it's all preference, and it's what your family wants for you and what you want for yourself. So, um, my myself personally, my family doesn't real, you know, a lot like push me to wear it or tell me that I have to wear it. It's my choice. So, if I wanted to start wearing it, I could. And if I don't want to wear it, I never have to wear it in my life. So, it's totally up to you. My personal um, thoughts is it's totally up to you, totally up to your family and what you know, how strict of a lifestyle you live. Um, me personally, I'm not, I don't think I'm ever going to wear it. I really don't plan on wearing it. It's not just, it's just not my thing. But if you uh, don't know if you should, consult with your family, talk with your family, talk with some of your closest friends that wear the hijab or are Arab or Muslim that wear it or any other race that does wear it um, or religion that does wear it. Um, but personally, no, I'm not going to wear it. I don't plan on wearing it. And uh, yeah, if you... Uh, if you, you know, need more help or questions, just, you know, contact me again. I'll help you. Um, I don't really, you know, I don't plan on wearing it. So, yeah. And uh, I think it's perfectly fine. It's preference, totally preference, and what's right for your family and your lifestyle. So, yeah, that is about it for the questions. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I didn't get to get to my uh, family, fitness family questions, but I'll answer those in my next Q&A. If you guys have any more questions that you'd like to ask me, Leave them in the comments down below or do it on my Ask FM. I just made one, so I'll have that the direct link down below where you guys can ask the questions. I'll be answering them there daily, and I'll also be putting them in these videos, and you'll get a chance to get a shout out. So, yeah, I hope you guys had, have an amazing day. I love you guys all so, 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 so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.